So this video is about how art therapy can assist recovering alcoholics and addicts. Therapy is about bettering your thoughts and mind to better your life, and the addition of art to this process can create a meditative state, a sense of control, a better picture of what the future can look like, and more. When someone is recovering, they can either abstain and do their best to change their ways or try to change their thought processes to a different state of mind. Um, the methods used by a creative therapist can be compared to methods used by a shaman healer. Um, AA is a spiritual approach to recovery, as the creative therapist or shaman is a spiritual healer. In the words of a creative therapist, the process is one of transformation. Miracles happen when addicts open, open themselves and discover the beauty of their inner nature. Most research of treatment using art and music therapy in accordance with treatments for a substance use disorder have been linked to the 12-step model. It's been shown that art therapy helps facilitate some of the steps because the creativity helps one op open up and accept their disease, or it can help them create an image of recovery that they can appreciate and look forward to. Um, and in this way, they change their state of mind. And in one study, um, their findings showed a positive and significant relationship between requiring 12-step meetings as a part of treatment and the use of art therapy and music therapy. This finding supports previous research that links the use of art and music therapy with a 12-step model and suggests that treatment centers continue to pair these treatments with a 12-step approach. The recommended approach is to combine art therapy with the 12-step program, um, and that helps the process along. And I would agree that this creates another outlet and option for addicts seeking help, and it could be something that they enjoy more and get more out of with the uh, art approach. Um, and in a lot of my research, I only found this in treatment centers. So I think um, something to consider would be taking these types of um, treatments outside of the treatment center and having meetings that just focus on art therapy. Um, so one form of art therapy is to have um, addicts and alcoholics draw their state of mind along the recovery process or their world um, as they see it. And um, something that's commonly represented is the theme of transformation of darkness to light. Um, and yeah, we're gonna look at three drawings by a patient um, named Mike F. And he's 18 years old when these drawings were done. And starting out with the first one, um, his drawing exhibits sadness, fear, and darkness. It's um, hellish and scary, exemplifying his childhood and addiction. Then moving on, um, this drawing was done a month into his active 12-step recovery. And at this point, he's found a sponsor and is leading a recovery group and feels more hopeful. It shows a transformation and climbing out of the depths of darkness into the world. And this next drawing exhibits finding the light and being a part of the world finally. Um, and uh, this is done in his third month and he was able to graduate from his treatment center's three month recovery program. And Mike F. is still doing well to this day. So these were just some examples of how art therapy currently helps addicts and alcoholics specifically and ways in which it works for them.